Hello, and welcome back to the Planet Crafter. So I actually found that episode that I thought was lost. So I think this is officially, let me count, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. This should be officially episode 10. We did have a, a short, small 10-minute episode that uh, I recorded back in 2022 of October when it was the last time I played. So... Um, during the last episode, we went over and found a cave over there, because we did explore that wreck before, but there was a cave over this way, which I marked with a green beacon, which brought us to this cool-looking field area that had the pulsar crystals and whatnot. I know there's another giant wreckage over there we have yet to explore, so I might go over that way and explore that. Um, we got up to 50 MTI, which I think constitutes as lakes, because I got the lake achievement when we logged in. So I think we are finally high enough that we just barely missed out on the water edge. Oh, one of them is barely in the water. So, yeah, that's kind of interesting. We also called that iridium uh, rocket down, and we have yet to find any of those meteors, so I put a couple of ore extractors over in the iridium mine, so hopefully that should get us some more iridium. Um, I still have a couple more to collect over in that osmium mine, and I might bring the materials over to put an extractor over there just to see, um, see what we can harvest over there. So let's grab two of this. Going to need to make a rod. Super alloy. What else? Aluminum and titanium. And then for a beacon, we need titanium, aluminum, silicone. We have water. Let's go check our food over here, see if this is finally done. Oh yeah, let's go, sweet, let those keep growing, let's put this over in the food section, we are getting low on space food, so might need to hit a couple more racks, oh, okay, let's do another storage chest, let's grab three iron, let's do this, So, this one can be food, this can also be water, this will just be water. Oh, we can make a bunch of these now, so let's do that. Um, we can probably, let's just make them like up here, so they're kind of out of the way, I think, would be a good idea. So, what do we need? Uh, I guess let's first go do that before we forget, and that will be the to-do list when we get back. Use all this water to make, um, to make, uh, all veg tube T3s, because they give, uh, significantly more oxygen, so... Which is weird that you can't put them inside, but it's fine. Okay, let's go over here. Oh, let's double check to make sure we have enough to make an ore extractor. We do. Okay. Let's go finish looting this cave. We'll put an ore extractor down over on this new um, area we found. So, should be uh, kind of fun. I just lit a, lit a candle, so I, I've been kind of getting back into candles recently. I bought a little... USB little like uh, one of those little X lighters that I've seen before, so it's rechargeable. But this is a uh, one from Walmart called Hidden Springs. It smells pretty good. I've also been using their Garden Rain one and the Alpine Forest. I like those, so I might have to grab a, a couple more of them. But I guess kind of got on a tangent. But 
we are traveling, so it doesn't necessarily matter. So this is the entrance over here. I don't think I finished looting this cave, so let's do that. Yes, thank you for the warning. Because I figured out you could fly around. That's still melting, so let's grab this. Oh man, there's a ton in here. Wow. Yeah, we need to get that ore extractor tier 2 for the osmium mine, and then we are sitting pretty. So I wonder if I wasn't supposed to be able to get over here yet. I mean, the ice was melting, but I was doing a little little reading and I thought that it said that the caves come in like stages so it looks like there's no more ice in this cave though because we got around this unless the unless the cave goes deeper down that way which it does not because we can see the wall there so I think yeah this whole this whole place melted which is kind of neat so now that we are over here and I want to get closer whoa I don't think I've seen that particle effect before I want to put one of these down and see what we get over here. What are you harvesting? Iron. Okay. Um, I think I might just let it go for a little bit just to see what's what. And I want to put a beacon over here. And we can do like a... Let's go to like a silverish color. Yeah, that works. I want to see if it gets anything else. It might not, so not a big deal if it doesn't. That that uh that affects a little a little trippy. Oh wow, osmium can spawn out here. It's nice. Oh, my oxygen. I've yet to build a. Oh. Forgot to build a living component over here. Titanium, iron. I'm gonna risk it without. I don't know if we could have made it back, so I think we got all the stuff we need. Uh, uh, I need, I think, one more iron. Iron, please. Iron, please. Wow, please don't tell me one iron. Uh, maybe on the drill. Oh, came in clutch. <gasps> no! Man. Okay. Yeah. Unfortunate. Okay. Let's go back. We just needed one more iron and we would have had that. So it's fine. I was not paying attention. So good thing we touched that little area. So it counted as a respawn. I don't think you lose the items in your inventory because it says you just drop some of them. So hope you don't like lose them because I, I never really. Ooh, Biodome tier 2. 55. It's kind of cool. Okay, yeah, we definitely gotta change that color. That color is hard to see. Let's go with like a gold. There we go. Okay, I think that was everything we had, hopefully. So let's do this. So now we can top up on our oxygen. New save point, which is nice. So yeah, I don't think we'll actually keep this here because we're not getting, I think we just get iron from it. No reason to keep that here. Zeolite? That is a new material. I have yet to see that one. The white rare ore. Yeah, okay. So that's kind of cool. We keep getting uh, achievements for getting some of these materials. Let's grab some more of this. Oh yeah, this is everywhere. I wonder if I come put the extractor over here. Let's see. Maybe we're not far enough in. See how it kind of goes to like a dark black? Yeah. So let's... Me this and then we'll go over here and maybe this will mine zeolites. This looks like a, a good spot. It's still iron, so I'll let it run for a little bit, see if it finds some. Oh, a new message. Oh, we gotta head back to base then. Do a little more exploring while we're over here. Was oh, that a super alloy? Oh, nice. 
crate, just a little crate action. Ooh, that was a really good crate. Not gonna lie, I also took a look at the, the map a little bit to see what it kind of looks like and some of the, the points that we have yet to hit. So I was taking a look at that. So I know, oh, that was Cobalt. I thought that was Osmia the way it was glowing. Oh yeah, there's some good resources over here. Oh yeah. Okay. Hey, <laughs> look at all the beacons we got. So, because um, we don't have room, I think I'll leave the ore extractor over here. Because I just wanted to check. Yeah, see. So, let me go make a locker. I have. Oh, I don't have three iron. Okay, so let's just run back. I will deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. Uh, deconstruct that extractor. So that we can use that somewhere else, maybe on iridium to make more um, jet engines to call more down uranium to get more power. Would be a terrible idea either. So let's head back. Oh, we also got a little base over here. I forgot. Yeah, we put this one while we were exploring this and that. Oh, man, we left a good amount of stuff over here. Uh, I guess drop the iron. Oh. Give me the food. Drop the magnesium. Give me the food. Drop. Oh, uh, yeah, I can't really drop anything for that, so. Okay, let's head back. So yeah, let's look at that that message, the biodome, and then we'll head back over there, potentially deconstruct that, or extractor, um, see if we can do anything with this new um, material, zeolites or whatever it's called. How's our algae working? Are we getting some more algae underwater? Doesn't look like it just yet, but I guess algae is kind of hard to see, so. Okay, let's go here, let's eat this, drop off the food. Left click, yeah. Seeds, this here, this here. Iridium, bop, 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 bop. Sulfur, got a lot of it now, which is kind of good. Uh, let's look at the message before we forget. Um, so we have two messages from Riley before. Let's go over those before we read the new one. Uh, finally, I managed to locate the system they sent to you. I don't have much time, but I'll try to give you some advice. The success rate of plant crafters is low because it's the only possible task. You should find space food in your pot and maybe in space racks. You'll be able to grow food by yourself when you meet the correct requirements. So try and find some vegetable seeds. Exploration and improvements are essential. Explore and improve your equipment. And then this one, I managed to sneak more information. I read that you have a greater chance of success if you build your base at an altitude. I'm not sure why. Oh, yeah, so I did read this. And I remember I was like, in an altitude, and it's because of water. And if you manage to heat the planet enough, some caves will become possible, which we did read to go try the thing. And one last thing you can try, encrypted. Use ore extractors in different areas to extract your materials and something wrong with the encryption, it looks like. Rockets are really important to help boost your generation of blank and more encrypted year 3058 year 3058 this is all year 3058 okay cool cool um biodome tier two i'm interested in what you do sweet let's make it oh wait that's not biodome tier two biodome tier two two fertilizer bacteria samples okay cool cool and decode the chip please oh display case nice Okay, let's put the, give me these, put this here, put these down, then these, followed by these, fabric, still don't know what to do with that, but we will figure it out, uranium, let's drop these off, cobalt, drop the super alloy, and the seeds, Check the vegetable growers while we're at it in the water. Oh yeah, what else? Biodome tier two. Bacteria sample. How do we make those again? Algae. Oh yeah, do we? Algae. 
Yeah, do we get those from the algae spreaders? I have yet to, I didn't really look at those. So. Okay. Um, don't know how to get algae. Maybe from algae tier 2? Because I think we did unlock that. It grows underwater algae, generates biomass. Yeah. Fertilizer we need. Uh, I might just double check the, the old Google to double check on how to get that. Yeah, let's, well, while we have a second. Oh, sounds like more meteors. Oh, I guess algae needs to grow in the actual water for you to collect it. That's kind of interesting. What are we dropping? Silicon, iron. So just regular, regular meteors, no iridium or anything. It's fine, I guess. Let me check this one out. Ah, they seem to be falling everywhere. Yeah, it just like looks like regular resources, so that's fine. Oh yeah, fertilizer and bacteria samples, so oh uh, yeah, how do we make fertilizer again? I think it's sulfur and eggplants. Sulfur algae. Oh so we do need those algae samples, so maybe we should put down more algae spreaders. Eggplant water, bioplastic nugget, super alloy. Oh, these aren't done yet. Dang, son. Gotta get more of those down. Food growers. Aluminum, iron, and water. We have a ton of those. So let's do that. How much power do we have? Ah, uh, we have... <laughs> Ah, wow, those ore extractors are kind of eating that up. How many uranium rods do we have? Two? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Fuck, we'd be one short uranium. Damn. Okay. Oh, I forgot we can craft super alloys, too. Okay. Let's do the food growers and put some more seeds down, because, yeah. G tier 3, silicon and magnesium. Let me grab that. Tier 3, silicon, magnesium. Yeah, see, they won't go in here. They don't go in here. They won't go in here. And they don't go in here. So, yeah, looks like we are going to put them outside. We'll move them up here. Oh, yeah, we can do foundations for them, too. That's a good idea. Like a little level area. Grab some iron.
weird. It won't let me um, connect those. Don't know why. Maybe they're too high. Oh, there we go. Okay, looks like we got a little something, something working here. There we go. Yeah, we can come over here and then we'll fit one more, maybe. There we go. So let's put stairs. Uh, let's see if we can link these. Okay, whatever, we don't need stairs. Let's do this. Oh, you can't put these on foundations? Oh, man. Brutal. Okay. Okay, well, we'll just spread these out over here, I guess. Oh! Goodness. Oh yeah, these give way more oxygen. Yeah, okay. So these don't spoil, which is good. No more mushroom seeds, which is a little disappointing, but I'll do squash and beans if I have extra. What is this? Squash? Yeah, okay. I guess I'll just do four eggplant then, yeah. Man, there is just a ton to this game. It's hard to remember it all. Excuse me. Yeah, let's go check the aluminum mine while we're while we're doing this. Still got to go back over there too to. to do some more collecting. Let's eat some food. Nice. Uh, aluminum. Oh yeah. 
So this was one, two, three, four, five, six aluminum in that one, and this was only four. So it is maybe RNG based? Kind of hard to tell. The locker over here, we'll just store um, the locker. Boom. We'll do iron in this one for now. this all back. Head over to the iridium mine. We'll grab the iridium. Oh, just so much to do. Unlocking so much stuff. Yeah, so algae's uh, another problem. We'll make some more algae spreaders. How much aluminum did we get? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, so maybe we'll make another, another mine over there just to really pump up our aluminum because kind of a little bit of our bottleneck so far is aluminum so store it all in there for right now we'll grab it probably in a little bit actually give me all our iron and a bunch of titanium we are just going to make this base massive No, I can't link over here. Dang it. It's unfortunate. Oh yeah, look at all the space we got. And yeah, that uh, that animation is a little, uh, I guess jarring would be the word. It's hard to remember what level you're on. Okay, let's do this, do this, this, this. One more titanium, we got one in here. Sweet. Let's make some. Uh, can we attach over here? We can. Iron and titanium. Just give me it all. I'm using it. Let's go upstairs. Hit this. Give me all the extra iron. Okay. Go down. Out. Now we're making some progress. Again, run over to the iridium mine. This thing's almost full already. Grab the iridium. Use that to maybe make some more heaters. These are probably way beyond full, but... Let's make some lockers. Let's 
run all this back to base because <laughs> we're probably going to need it. I uh, hope the. I got to look to see when we unlock the next bigger backpack. Kind of glad we built up here. Nice flat area. Got a little spot. Oh, yeah. Let's pop some more drills down. We need the pressure for the next uh, ore extractor. Still got to go back over there, by the way, too. Yeah, we got a lot of iridium. Silicon's about to. Oh, silicon is full. Cobalt is full. Okay. Give me some of this. We'll go run it upstairs instead. Uh, make a rod. Because save some space. Drop off a ton of silicon up here. Drop off cobalt. Magnesium is basically full up here too, which is lovely. Drop off the titanium. We got room downstairs. Oh yeah, um, unlocks, backpack T3, T2, what are we on, T5, lake water, collects and filters water from a lake. Did we not get a bigger backpack ever? Oh no. Oh no, teleporter? <laughs> oh my god. False art crystal, yeah, no shit. Okay, cool. So, T5 might be the highest. Auto crafter. Oh, that's sweet. Skeleton T3. Um, lake water. Ooh, okay. Wait, it's not too bad. And then, what else do we want to do? Oh, yeah. Drill T4 at 41 heat. So, yeah, let's drop drop three heaters. What do we need for those? Silicon, titanium, aluminum. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Let's go upstairs. Heat go up. Uh, lake water collector. How many bioplastic? We do have three. I don't know if I want to spend it all on that. We can't make fertilizer. We got eggplants. Uh, how do we make bioplastic nuggets? I forget. Mushroom, mushroom, silicon water. Mushroom, mushroom, silicon water. Mushroom, mushroom, silicon water. Mushroom, 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 mushroom silicon. Sweet. Grab those. Are these done? Nope. Okay. Make some more food growers. Some veg T3s while we're at it. Oh, I haven't checked this console in a while. Insects. Yep. Some have gotten there. Uh, biomass. We are working on it. Uh, plants. We get a beehive at 80. Tons, damn. Okay, heater T5. Ooh. Okay, at 8.3 kilotons. Damn. Damn, this game is going to be a grind, no doubt. Okay, so yeah, let's throw down some more LGT ones. So now that we have, let's use all our bioplastic nuggets for that. And then we need to go find some more mushroom seeds, I think, too. It'd be kind of clutch. And let's double check on the power, because we can call down another uranium thing. How are we doing on power? Uh, getting a little close. Um, eggplants, water, magnesium. Oh, 
Oh, and a super alloy. Damn, that's gonna hurt. Yeah, let's do four for now. Four eggplants. And four magnesium. We get closer to this. Dang, let's switch these. So we're doing forty three eight five per second, fifty six hundred pressure. Biomass is going up slowly and making a decent amount of oxygen too. Uh, let's make some drills. We haven't done that in a little bit. Iron, iron, titanium, and aluminum. One, two, three, four, Where my grass spider at? I just deconstructed one. I gotta build it. Yeah, flower spider. Oh yeah, fertilizer. So yeah, this should have should have upped our pressure a little bit. Yeah. Need to find something to do with cobalt. We got too much of that stuff. Same with magnesium too. Oh, we're gonna need to go find some more super alloys. That's what we need. Hundred percent.
to go hit the iridium mine, and then we still got to go over there and grab that extractor, and then maybe do a little, little searching for some more seeds. Oh, there we go. Now it's now it looks like it's growing. Maybe it bugs out if you don't place any like new ones. You know what I mean? Like same with the grass. The grass stopped growing because you didn't place a new one in a while, or maybe the texture just disappears or something. Yeah, it could be something weird like that. Now we're just swimming in aluminum. I love it. And I added another extractor over there as well. So we are doing good. Bo show. Um, let me grab the water out of these. Put these back. Oh yeah, what do we need for veg two, two, threes? Uh, silicon, magnesium, and aluminum water. Okay. We make five. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. And then. Two silicon, so I need 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And then 6 magnesium, right? 4, 5, 6, yes, it should be 6 veg tubes. Yeah, I know, I wish we could really place these indoors. Or maybe they can go in a biodome tier 2, but having a little trouble getting the. Uh, Fertilizer needed for that. Sweet, so let's grab six of our best seeds. Let's see if the plants are done growing. Oh yeah, let's go. Need some more mushroom seeds. That is for show. Okay. Um, oh yeah, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Thirty-nine, thirty-nine, and then these are doing fifty-two. Yeah. I think we're actually doing really good with food for once, so that's nice. Oh, now let's check the iridium mine. And then we got to do some exploring at some point, so let's get that done as well. Oh yeah, this one's almost back full already, these two. Oh, wow, no iridium in that one. So yeah, we need super alloys. We can craft them, but they're easier to find, that's for sure. So maybe we can find some more. Actually, what do you need to craft them? Oh, aluminum included? Oh god, I do not want to start spending my aluminum to craft those. grab the rest of the stuff. Uh, we'll go over there, grab that other ore extractor, maybe do a little more exploring over that way. Maybe find a couple more super alloys because we definitely need those. Wow, I can't believe we're almost at 80. I never thought we'd even get to 100. I figured that would take forever, but yeah, the compounding effect working pretty good. Hmm. 
Mm, that candle smells really good. Really good. Yeah, I swear, like, my table, or my computer desk that I have is not level. I never took a level to it, and uh, the candles always burn with, like, uneven to them. So, kind of bugs me a little bit sometimes, but no biggie. Because I miss out on burning part of the, the wax. Oh, that was weird. Call down another, um, another uh, uranium so we can make another power plant because we are close to capping out. So that will be next. Let's go over here. I'm going to take a sip of water while we're, we're flying over. Headset just died, so hopefully the audio is still recording on this. We are getting kind of close to this episode's end, so if we lose the last, you know, 10 minutes of audio, not a not a horrible thing. But I've unplugged my headset before, and it normally um, whoa, that was laggy. Um, it normally uh fixes itself, so I'm not too worried. So yeah, these resources definitely don't respond, which is okay. I almost saw the ice is melted. Uh, let's go up here. Super alloys. We'll get rid of this drill because it's probably just getting regular stuff. Have a little oxygen base here. Always use more aluminum. Zelolite. I haven't even figured out what we need for yet, but might as well grab it. Chests are always good with stuff. Nice. That. Let's look at our drill. See if we got anything special over here. We did not, so um, let's let's make a little storage over here. Come back and delete the drill. I know that's a really cool effect. So we got the ore extractor back. Oh, and we are capped out already. Nice. You need super alloys though, so I'm gonna drop some of the stuff off here. We don't really need cobalt or magnesium. I think we have a ton of so. And iron, we have a ton of too. Titanium, we also have a ton of so. Gonna drop all that here. This is all stuff we need. Right, let's do some exploring for some more super alloys that we found over here. Let's head over this way, see if we can get to like the world edge or something. Like I said, I took a peek at the map, so I kind of kind of get an idea where we're going, so we're not just blindly walking about. But it is always fun to explore naturally, so I didn't I didn't go too in depth with it. Can super alloys spawn up here? That would be cool. I think we got lucky finding all those super alloys up there. I mean, it is kind of obvious because they have the little, um, the little broken down beams or whatever you want to call them that show you where, uh, uh, let's have iron, silicon, titanium, is it another iron, uh, another iron, and another iron and titanium, yeah, another iron. One more iron. Nope, I don't think I need that. I need iron just in case we want to make a little base. Iron, please. Good gravy, I swear. It's like you find this stuff all the time, and the second you look for it, just you'll never find it. It's like the game trying to kill you. 
Oh, there we go. So, haven't seen any more osmium. Found a couple of quartz crystals, and I could be flying over the super alloys, not gonna lie. I've been trying to look for them, but they don't really stick out the most, per se. Whoa. Oh, this is cool. Someone else started building a a base. You can go underground. Oh. oh wow, that's a lot of super alloys. Nice. Alright, let's build our own base over here. Yeah, yeah. Iron, iron. Oh my goodness, I thought we had enough. Okay, there we go. So it looks like this was another survivor over there here, and they just couldn't get enough um, enough resources flowing for them. So yeah, it looks like they ran into some trouble. It's kind of cool that we can't deconstruct that. Want to go underground and see what's over there? Deconstruct racks. Oh, okay. Oh, another microchip. Sweet veg tube. Oh, that's a cool. Okay. So yeah, someone was failed survivor over here, I guess. And I don't ever... Oh yeah, we did find another underground part. So, okay, here we go. Okay, I wasn't expecting that my landing site would be so bad, but there is no reason I won't be able to terraform this big rock. I have enough knowledge about the process to see it. All I have to do is follow the steps, hope for good weather, and not too many meteors. It can't be that hard. Year 3055, and we're in year 3080, Zio Don, Zao Oh man, we're in a space. Okay. Let's go back up. I know we can go back down. Do I have enough iron for a big locker? I don't think I do. Do I? No, I'll make a small one. That's fine. Cobalt, iron, titanium. Okay, let's go back down there. So yeah, that's, that's kind of cool. Grab these, go down one more. Okay, let's get rid of the door. Another message. It's been harder than expected. The outside is toxic and the seeds won't really grow underground. My calculations tell me that the planet's position should be the best terraform around two years. I just have to survive until then. Zeodon. Interesting. How many times can we go down? Jeez. Ooh, technical debris? That might be massive. Okay. So we had a bed. Seed Lerma. Oh, he had an iridium rod too and a microchip. Okay, yeah, we gotta we gotta go back. Uh and where am I supposed to find more iridium on this planet? I scouted everywhere without success. There's ice everywhere. It's critical that I find something to start healing the planet. Everything outside is freezing. I just have to sleep tomorrow will be better. The sentence for something so small is inhumane, I don't deserve it. True on that, bud. Alright, let's go back up top. One, <laughs> two, three. Okay. And let's run back to base because most of the stuff is, in fact, important. So we'll run back to base, drop all this off, come back immediately. Maybe check the mines, but... Oh yeah, here is this pod. <gasps> Ooh, even more in here. Dang. Okay. Alright, yeah. Oh, and another message. Almost missed that. Welcome to your assigned planet. Your mission is to advance the terraform process of this world. Generate O2 heat and pressure to do so. First, reach 1.75 Ti and create a blue atmosphere. Sentinel Corp, year 3055. Yep, that was the guy who got sent down here. Cool. Okay. So I think gold is the base, and then red is the little marker I made for the cave. Probably don't have to go back through the cave. We might be able to go around and over. Oh man, and a blue ch crate. Dang, mushroom seeds? No, bioplastic though. Curious what happens if I just go over. Oh, you can't. Interesting. Okay, let's head on back. And we'll come back to that rack, grab some more stuff. And while we were exploring, it was a cool part of this game loop is that we're at 89 Terraform. I think we went over when we were at like 80. So, yeah, it's kind of 
kind of cool. Okay. Yeah, I'm glad uh, we've been recording this. It really shows the the progress, and I love looking back at my old playthroughs and just scrolling through and seeing what it was. So maybe one day I'll archive them or something, or I don't know. Be funny. Oh, moss started to form. Is that is that moss? Is that grass? Wow. Oh yeah, moss on the rocks too. I think you can see it from like underground. Yeah, that's cool. That looks mossy. Yeah, I thought Mostin started at 100, but maybe it's starting to form. That's cool. Can I get algae? Wow. Oh, yeah. We got algae. Oh, sweet. Yeah, we got to go grab all that. Okay, cool, cool. All right, let's decon chip the... Yeah, let's decode one. GPS T3. Jetpack T3. Let's go. That's so easy too. Okay, yeah. Methane cartridge. Yeah, but we can make fertilizer now too, so that's that's good. Oh, we got three rods, let's do that. Sulfur, drop that off. Jetpack T three, what do we need? Two osmium super alloy and explosive power. What else? S super alloy, explosive powder. I think it's sulfur. And what else? Two sulfur and one iridium. Okay. So how does a T2 go? 170 propulsion? Sweet. Jetpack T3, take off the T2, T3, nice, let's see, ah, uh, feels a little faster, how much is it, 190, so we got 20 more, so that's kind of cool, and then uh, T3 reactor, 3 water, another explosive powder, okay, Let's go grab the algae too before we forget. Man, this game just gets so intense so fast. So we can't grab algae on that one, but one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is nuts. Gotta add more water spreaders, I think, or algae spreaders so we can get some more uh, algae growing too. Oh, eight, nine, ten. It's crazy, man. Crazy. Sweet. I think 
you need three for the T is super alloy to sulfur and iridium. Let's go over the iridium mine too. What else? Oh, super. Yeah. Pop one of those down. Oh, yeah, explosive powder. Yoink. Boom. Let's go. It should give us a crap ton more power. What does this generate? Is it 300 one of these pumps out? Yeah, 331. Nice. Let's grab some food. We need our last that. Let's check if the plant's ready. We'll run over the iridium mine. Oh yeah, good thing we checked these. Food. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, uh, uh, iridium mine and aluminum mine too. Grab this. Yeah, I know it's been a while. Grab all that. Grab all that. Drop off the non-essentials. Actually, we'll just make two trips, right? Yeah, we can. Do we need to, though? Yeah. I'm Man, when we get a bigger backpack, I need it, but... <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot. We, uh... We didn't end the episode yet, so I think uh, we'll end it there. Next time, we'll go back, finish exploring that rack. Seemed to be a lot of good stuff over there. Finally got LG to make the fertilizer. To, uh, I forget what we needed to make with that. So, yeah, I just got to run back over to the iridium mine, top up on all of our materials, make sure that we're storing it all, because eventually we probably will need it. So it's nice, though, that we have the mines getting most of the raw resources for us now, and we can just, uh, you know farm out the or build out the important stuff you know because it's kind of you want to avoid going for just getting resources over and over again that gets a little tedious so iron ba -ba 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 -ba, boom boom all right but yeah no i think that's a good spot to call it so yep we'll go touch up the finish grabbing the aluminum mine go touch that up and then go back over there and finish exploring that so let's save and uh yeah until next time